We are on. Whoa. Ew. 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 <laughs> hey. hey everybody. It's stream. We haven't done this in ages, but we've been so busy. I'm sure you all understand how it is. So, yeah. 2020, new decade. Got to get this game done and stuff. So, yeah, but we're going to show you everything that we've been kind of working up up, up until this point. So, uh, so, yeah, it's going to be fun. I have Carly with me. Yo. And I have Hi. Steve with Hello. me. Hello. Yo. This <laughs> <laughs> is making sounds really. <laughs> Can you... Wow, Steve, 18 month streak. Oh. Dang, nice. Sir Kane, 17 month streak. Ooh. One of these days, one of y'all is going to forget. <laughs> Can you forget, or is it I automatic? Know. It's just automatic. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fair enough, then. Um, just for the people in Discord, can you guys see the stream okay? Oh, yeah. It's okay. pretty. Yeah. Yeah, it looks great. Mm, cool. I'm so, guys. Just to let you know what's what's going on. If there are any technical problems, I'm streaming to you through OBS while doing a live a live stream through Discord, so people can instantly see what I'm doing. So, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> so if if everything blows up, it's uh, <laughs> it's going to be my fault. But uh, yeah, hope you're I'm all mostly doing looking good. at the Twitch chat, so I can make sure if anyone asks anything. So I'm sure we're gonna have some questions today. Oh yes, we are. I think we are. For sure. You guys are gonna see some differences in this demo to what you've probably seen previously. Um, I'm not gonna spoil anything, but uh, yeah. So without further to do, uh, I'm gonna have a sip of peach iced tea, and then we're gonna crack on. I uh, got mm. myself a cold brew with salted cold foam so it's just salted whipped cream essentially Ooh. so good <laughs> nice all right here we go so there's a question already that i'm gonna <clears throat> i'm gonna answer is rebecca's intro line changed or changing and the interesting thing is that that first line was the only one that we've done so far that's original and the rest are from the original game so I think everything's going to be changing. Yeah. At least some point. Yeah, I've rewritten all of the uh, audio logs. Um, so we'll see We'll see how that goes. Oh, thank you very much, Track of Star, for the 100, the 100 triangles. Dang. The 100 triforces. Yeah, and this intro here that we put together is just... It just was temporary for the demo. It's not a uh, replacement for a cinematic or any other kind of exposition. Mm -hmm. Yep. Right. Second we go. question, is the hacker going to be apprehended in Atlanta still? <laughs> I don't know. I've never been to Atlanta. Uh, I've been to New Orlando. It's very cyberpunky. Atlanta's nice. Nope. Oh, we oh, have a hey. voice in here that I don't think anyone's heard before. Hey, Kevin. Hey, how's Kevin, going? Kevin, introduce yourself. I've been on yourself. stream like once. Hey, once? I'm okay. Kevin. Um, I do like props and stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the best way to describe it. Uh, Tugla wants to say, is the first mutant always going to be at the door or roam like the original? Uh, he will always be at the door. Um, he's set up that way. Uh, but um, the rest are obviously roaming. Oh, the, the volume might be a bit weird on the, on some levels on this. Sorry, so this is a this is kind of a new computer. It didn't have the uh, Streamlabs set up um, until quite recent. So if if, oh, if yeah. volumes are too loud or too low, let me know and I'll go and adjust it all. Uh, but yeah. Sometimes I forget to adjust those levels too. Mm -hmm. And then our notification sound just blasts everyone. <laughs> Did you fix your spelling error? Which one? What? The, it used to say cryogenetic that. or something. <laughs> oh, that ah! spelling error you mean? <laughs> yeah. It's oh, funny. Kevin, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's a status screen. You are free to leave. 
behalf of Trioptimum, welcome back to reality. Oh, nice touch. <laughs> so, so every just to get, let you guys know how this works. So each one of these um, like objects, they have a date table associated with them. We go in and we have to do, we we write all the kind of dialogue ourselves. It's been mainly me, uh, with some uh, some of Matt's to kind of start it off, but. Um, yeah, every single one of these things when you mouse over it needs a description and some text and yeah that's a lot of work <laughs> so uh, or is asking are we going to see the OST collection of level soundtracks soon so I guess maybe an upload of that I'm not sure is that a John thing <clears throat> I don't know it's uh, kind of a weird question yeah, I'm assuming that they're asking if we're going to post up the soundtrack soon. For the original game, we had a remaster done by John that is included in the big box edition that came out with Limited Run. And also the vinyl record. And I think we're going to put that on YouTube. Oh, hmm, okay. We definitely should. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't get the vinyl, so now I want to make my own bootleg vinyl. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hacker man. You know how they used to do that? The bootlegs? Yeah, bootleg vinyls. No. They would, like, buy an original vinyl, and then they would make a mold of it, and, like, pour their own wax. Oh, nice. Because you literally had to make a copy of it. I'm going to have to play the data reader. That means Rebecca's going to talk for a bit, so you probably won't be heard over her. Jeez, Rebecca. I always know. talking. Good. <laughs> Nominate the conversation. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Finally got someone. All right. My name is Rebecca Lansing. I'm a counterterrorism consult for Triopolis. First things first. Get something to defend yourself with. Things on Citadel Station are bad, very bad. The comms are dead and there is strong evidence of a biological contamination on board. And that's not the worst part. The station's mining laser is charging for a potential strike against Earth. Nathan Darcy is the science officer on board. He'll have information on shutting the laser down. His office is on your level near the central hub. Get there immediately. See what you find. <laughs> Right, we are free to talk again. Oh, we've seen we've seen a level one hype train emote. Yeah. I don't it's know. It's hype griffin. I had never seen this before, but it's also been a while since we've streamed. <laughs> <laughs> Emotes are being delivered to supporters. I have no idea what's going on. Is Twitch melting down? Oh yeah. Oh god, what have we done? <laughs> <I t> <laughs> <laughs> it's just so much hype right now. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Did we uh there's an update coming soon. Did we want to <laughs> let everybody, all the backers, know that we were doing this? Oh, yeah. So uh, we <laughs> do have a, a Kickstarter update coming at the end of the week. Um, you know, it, it, it's coming. We wanted to squeeze as much into it as possible. Plus, we did two updates last month. So, yeah. Um, in general, is this an updated build from, like, I don't, I don't know how you're doing the, the builds, or if you want to let people know how uh, often you plan to update it. We don't really have a set in stone plan for that kind of stuff. It's just a case of, so we need to, we, we got the demo out of the date we, we planned, and then it was just kind of emergency polish for what we had, but mm -hmm. we're kind of... What I'd like to do personally is get medical almost as close to 100% as we possibly can before we release another one. But Matt talked to me earlier uh, today and said, uh, when are we going to push it? Because it would be better if we did one sooner rather than later. So I'm thinking, maybe at the end of this week? That would give me enough time to get enemy respawning into medical. There are some enemies that oh, do awesome. respawn in this build that I'm going to show off, but not true 100% roaming around the station. Uh, respawning yet. That will happen, but um, yeah. oh, I got a soda. Oh, I have some 
backer kit information for people that are backers or want to be backers. Um, I can post up the backer kit link in a moment, but I know a lot of people have DM'd me and I've been getting to them. I've literally have had like maybe three to 400 DMs like over the past week. <coughs> and I feel like every time I answer one, I get five more. <laughs> and I'm realizing this is because not everyone um, has actually really used backer kit that much. Um, and so I'll relink the backer kit. Um, the demo was, uh, sent out to people who backed on Steam specifically because the demo is on Steam. So we use that method to determine who would want to download the demo that way. But, you know, I get that there's a lot of people who want to play the demo who didn't back for Steam. So uh, we did put up some extra keys. And if you go to Backer Kit and redo your survey um, and switch to Steam, you will get that key and we will announce before we close backer kits so people can adjust their backings if they want to in the future. Um, as well as um, some people did back on Steam and they don't see their key. For some reason, for some people's surveys, you have to redo them because um, it's stuck in a pending state. And that's on backer kits end, not our end. So there's not much I can do to fix it rather than you just resetting your own. Yeah. So let me post the backer kit link again, but that's that's the backer kit corner of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> the more you know. Boom boom. Beep boop. Beep bop. I'm rolling in sodas. <clears throat> I'm hurt though. That patch clips through his wrist. I think we need to fix that. It does. Yeah. <laughs> we'll fix it. I haven't seen the animation yet. Ah. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you just see it? Yeah. <laughs> I've been at ZBrush for like four days. <laughs> <laughs> Will the remastered version of the OST be in the game at some point, the one from the vinyl? Um, I think, don't quote me on this. I want to say that we're going to use that remastered OST in this game as a alternative soundtrack. But don't quote me on that. <laughs> um... Someone's asking, have you been simultaneously planning the UI for GamePad? Oh, um, not at the moment. It's, we're just kind of getting everything up and running first, but it shouldn't be too hard to do. I can't imagine so. Matt is very uh, clever. Our program is clever. Someone did a... Someone did a redeemed highlight message, which is also a new feature I've never seen before, just like uh, Mickey Wilson did. And they said, can we ask uh, Ramon uh, to take a break from Westworld to come hand some help for the music? Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, Dan, you I've, should uh, this... choose a different HUD color just for fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, do that. Change the HUD color. Change it to purple. No, I'm changing it to orange. You beat me wow, to it. Rude. Purple's the best. Purple. 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 Purple's nice, Purple. but... Oh, Ooh, hazardous. Hazardous. I didn't know we had orange yet. I asked Matt just before the demo. I said, hey, Matt, I like orange. Could you sneak an orange color in? He was like, yeah, okay. <laughs> so he did oh. it, and I got my orange <laughs> I got my orange hood in before the uh, the, de That's the funny. deadline. They should I, just I change the name the to uh, Sal Salic Skin. Oh, my God. <laughs> Security's closing. I thought it would called Night Dive Purple. The are frozen. <laughs> Myra keeps saying that it's the cameras and the medical CPU core. All right, Dan, go kill something. Using these to hold okay. the level. That's all fine, but I don't really see how it helps. The thing is everywhere. Really whips mama's ass. Someone's asking where the orange jumpsuits are. And I don't even think all of our people are even dressed yet. Yeah, the we clothes so are coming. Clothes. 
<laughs> it, we'll have um, a fashion show. You look at the screenshots on Steam, I think there's some shots of the mutants wearing clothes, and we ended up um, redoing the mutant again. Yeah. Like the fourth time. <laughs> and so all those clothes perfect. just have to be weighted. Yeah, so they're coming. Shit, I'm going to talk now. Welcome back to Citadel Station. We hope your somnolent healing stage went well. Today is the sixth day of November, year 2072. You are currently in the healing suites located on the first level. Level two contains the research laboratories. Three houses the department. Like <laughs> the Citadel Station nudist colony and sanctuary in space. <laughs> The, flight deck is the on only place five. you could be naked uh, legally six in space. <laughs> oh my god. And executive suites. And level seven is systems engineering. Level eight houses the Department of Security. The bridge is located on level nine and energy systems on level R. Um, I have questions that I might ask. Anything you can in, tell in, us about miscellaneous in, apps for the interface? We hope you have a pleasant stay Ooh. on Citadel Station. I don't know. Nothing spoilerific though. Mm, Tugla uh, mentioned that they asked about gamepad um, stuff because uh, they're worried about keypads and puzzles with it, which I can understand that part for sure. Yeah. Oh, that poor guy. <laughs> he is my favorite. I love how purple he is. Maybe I just love purple too much. <laughs> my hair is purple again. Gunther was killed today. I always feel bad killing him. I can't him. let myself think about it. He's just doing his job. I think I understand how Shodan is doing it. He was just a simple you know, man trying to make his way in the universe. <laughs> Shodan loses some of its control over the station. Just wants to feed his children. I think it's I can not restore manual control in the easy hospital. Work, but it's honest work. <laughs> <laughs> so performance of this feels better. It's it shouldn't in the next version it should no longer really tank the frame rate. Also, um some of the frame rate I guess also could be because you're streaming to two different things right now. Oh no, it was just this thing where if you okay. open this puzzle, it would just tank the frame rate. Oh uh, yes, it, yes, yes. It needed right. optimization. That's done that. So we this is what I get for looking at Twitch rather than <laughs> you know. I gotta keep an eye on the question. Yeah. Press tab to open your inventory and examine or equip the spot beam. Energy weapons draw power from your energy pool. They certainly do. Uh. Titus7 is asking, so what is the reason for rewriting all the audio logs? Um, so in the floppy version, there's added text that you don't hear when um, the the CD, the CD audio is quite shortened in some cases from what's actually in the game. So I was kind of given the opportunity to merge the CD audio with the floppy text and combine them into something that's um, probably a bit more kind of interesting to read. Like if you don't know, um, if you don't read the, um, the text of the floppy, you wouldn't, be, you wouldn't realize that um, Myra is talking about her husband. I mean, she just says in her audio log, like Gunther was killed today. Like who, who's Gunther? But you actually read in the audio log text that it's her husband, so. Yeah, the, just kind of stuff like that that we can kind of expand on. We have the we have the technology. We have the technology. That's fine. Ooh, 
He had a whole magazine on him. All the loot is random, by the way. But kind of random. From Don't set. we have the new Ke Kevin? Can you do the uh, the new ladders? Yes, but I did not put them in yet. Or they're <laughs> in engine, but they're not built yet. Maybe we will, can get Kevin to do a dev stream sometime soon. That would be cool. Okay. If you're brave enough. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> we now Ooh, that's have, nice with the orange. We have an we have a now fully rotating station. Uh, it didn't yeah. rotate in the version that's on Steam at the moment, but this version oh. you can't you can quite see it if you look. But we are rotating ever so slightly. Wow. Wow. <laughs> never we might it. even be rotating in real life. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> that, that reminds me of that line from Malcolm in the Middle. We're going 30,000 miles an hour and you don't even realize it. We. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just looked out my window. I think I realize it. <laughs> Dang. It's pretty fast out there. Oh, he's got a clip as well. Wow. Better go get that gun. I better. Oh, this is looking really good, guys. Nice job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad it's looking so good. I spent a lot of time on it. It looks like the, uh, the lighting and post-processing changes that uh, Chris did are looking really fantastic. Yeah, there is no area in the game now that's fully black. Uh, so, um, yeah. Yeah. It smells like up dog in that room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, Mickey. <laughs> yes, thank you for those hundred of shape thing, the cheer. Yeah. So set it up so that, um, actually I shouldn't really say what I've talked to our program about, about cool things that you might be able to find, so I uh, might leave that. Are you guys still there? Well, I'm here. Oh, I'm just no. watching the chats. Yeah, just very interested in what you're doing. <laughs> very engrossed. By that you mean you're reading Twitter. Oh, yeah. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you imply that? Master Forsaken joins us. Thank you. Thank you for that follow. And his love 93 also followed. Did that guy just respawn? He might have done. Oh boy. He might have been there. He might have, he might have just wandered down here and found this corpse, you know. It's they they, they can do that. They do things. <coughs> Who are you to judge? I'll go this way. 
Thanks, Arcane's asking how many unique doors are in the game. <laughs> Never enough. So many. I think all the doors in the entire game are done, aren't they? <laughs> no. I feel like that was, like, they were almost completely finished with that before most things. They just got yeah, door I, crazy. I thought that was the, the thing, is that all the doors in the game were going to be done <laughs> first. <laughs> yeah. I thought that too. Real fake doors. <laughs> I really like the new floor in medical. Oh yes, let's let's enjoy it. Oh yeah, that does look good. Wait. Oh, you didn't kill him first, did you? <laughs> no, it's not behind him. So they, so enemies will react based on how much noise you make around them. You might have seen me earlier hit the wall with my pipe to lure an enemy over. Um, I did see that. You can, you can do that. Oh, are you gonna do the thing? Do the thing. I might do. The, I might do the thing. We'll see. <laughs> People keep asking if you can flush the toilets. Yeah. The real questions. I feel like flushing toilets is the difference between like a 75 and a 90% on Metacritic. Oh yeah. Do it. Do it. Oh, oh you missed. I missed. No. <laughs> Come on. Take two. This time it's for real. Well, where are you? He's like, where did you go? There we go. Nice job. It was worth it. Now it's an immersive sim. <laughs> oh, seen the donks come out. Where is John? Where did he go anyway? <laughs> Probably Status a doctor report. somewhere out there in the universe. Up in the beta quadrant behind he never stops. Trench. The donks are scavenging for food in the corridors and nesting in gamma. I sent a party to the west wing for supplies maybe 12 hours ago. Nathan Darcy is thinking up ways to disable the mining laser. It looks like we might hold them off. People are asking about um, durability of items and if you will get fatigued. You can get fatigued in the game. I actually was talking about that to Matt. Uh, with Matt today uh, about what we're kind of going to do but for weapon degradation that's more of a shock 2 thing rather than a shock 1 thing so we haven't really discussed it it's never been really on the table um, so I'm going to say no <laughs> at this point yeah every two shot your gun will jam mm. <laughs> just I'm... like shock 2 <laughs> am I bad for giving away secrets I shouldn't be Ooh. Man, this is a special stream with only our closest friends. <laughs> if any survivors can hear me, please. Some of us are still resisting Shodan. We have a sanctuary in Beta Quadrant, guarded by a radioactive trench. There's a force bridge that operates off a wiring panel. If you're coming in from Alpha, our guards will extend the bridge for you. Very careful. Are all over the car. As per usual, we're getting cyberspace questions, and I want to leave it cyberspace kind of as a surprise. <laughs> like, that's the number one thing I don't want to spoil. Yeah, don't click that, Dan. Oh, bullets have actual travel time? A bit like System Shock 2, so it, you, when you fire it doesn't instantly hit the target. Oh, 
I missed again. No. Get good, bro. You need gamer fuel by Mountain Dew. <laughs> I'm gonna make my own gamer fuel. It's called Nas. Oh, the drinks I drink are a Nas. Ugh, man, I drank Nas before I had my cold brew, and I don't know what I'm doing with my body now. <laughs> That's not good. I yeah. I just if I die. I uh... know exactly why. <laughs> <laughs> iced coffee and I feel like still jittery really I still yeah. don't I haven't gotten a feel like that in a very long time <laughs> yeah. sometimes I just feel like my skeleton wants to leave my body though oh we all have those days yeah. Most days, actually. <laughs> yeah. He wants to escape this prison. Alright, Althea. We can destroy the laser by firing it into the station's own shields. Isotope X-22 is stored in the science level, nope. and we need to bring says, it down to the reactor level to by the, small the features like lean. Then you turn them on, hmm. use the safety override code to enable Maybe the laser and fire. The laser controls well, the available on, on the science level and the override codes in the science Same. library. I have no idea how you're going to do all this, but good luck. Nathan keeps his office very tidy. Princess Perps, is this, is this game going to have the bleep sweeps and the creeps? <laughs> I'm sorry, who? <laughs> <laughs> their name is Princess Perp. I'm sorry, I'm just reading their name. Those sound like uh, factions in the Warriors or something. Ah, uh, I love that movie. The Baseball Furies are like... What random loot will we get? Ooh, bullets. I like hey. the way, like, when the floor Ooh. moved, it just looks so cool. <laughs> I got lucky that. Oh, the animation for the floor? Yeah, I really like yeah. it. Hey, uh, actually, Dan, that that reminds me, that uh, mm -hmm. that opening there, it's going to need a... Ooh, oh, it's going to need a, a special, special uh, ladder. Yes. He shot through the floor. How did he do that? I'm going to have to talk to Matt about that. Shot through the floor and you're too late. Wait, <laughs> you're to blame. Uh, I, I don't know the words to that, that song. <laughs> I was like, don't say it, Carly. Don't say it, Carly. Okay, I said it. Uh, what I am hoping to talk to Matt about, I'm not sure how expensive this will be, but to have the corpses react to the... Uh, direction of the uh, grav lift. That'd be cool. Ooh, that thing, the screen is broken again. Yeah, it's broken again. I'll have to talk to Matt about that. How's that happen? I have a laundry list for Matt. Koshiro so just wrote, shots with the floor and, and your two blame system shots is a good to game. Deck and escape instead. <laughs> Hopefully, there's still some weapons in the armory we can use against the mutants. Todd Blankenship was able to get the combination 705 from a security officer. We're going to try for it tomorrow. I'm hyped. There we go.
<coughs> and another one. Looks like the enemies aren't doing their, um... Oh, you know what? I forgot that we're... They're switching all that to root motion animation, right? To get the, uh... The turns in? Yeah. Actually, I think some of the turns are in. Um, you just don't see them, because usually... We might be able to. I might be able to get into a situation where we can. The resistance faction led by Keith Swanson left a week ago. We found the mutants fighting over the remains this morning. We're caught between the mutants and the cyborgs, so I'm worried whether we can carry out Darcy's plan. We're going to send Alan and Carl through the cyborg territory to reach the elevator. It's always funny when that audio log plays, because I'm like, that's not Jonathan's voice. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. That's legit. Carl one of my favorite back rooms. from recon without Alan. He says they took Alan the into a room marked Cyborg oh, yeah. Conversion. And now he's a cyborg assassin. Looks pretty Carl cool. marked the room with the word here before he ran. It matched uh, the, the orange says we line pretty well. Flip a switch and make the converter a surgery unit again. With only 12 of us left, though, it may Ooh, be an the academic. Chip bags point. are not eatable? Maybe someone else should have been leader. That is a scandal. <gasps> a scandal? Bot. In which game? This one. We don't have chip bags. Shut it down. <laughs> oh, right, those are biohazard bags. Right? Yeah, they're waste, they're waste, they're, yeah, what are these? Do you want to eat the biohazard bags? They're waste bags. Nothing special. Not worth picking up. Might be hazardous. We need bags of chips, though, that the monkeys have oh. in System Shock 2. <laughs> I always feel That's bad. You building. kill those cute little monkeys, and then you're like, you loot their little monkey bodies. And all he has on him is a bag of chips. Like, he was just minding his own business, eating some potato chips, and you shot him in the head. He's all that in a bag of chips. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, um. Does it look smooth on stream? It's getting a little choppy on our end. Or at least for me uh, it is. On Twitch it looks fine. Oh. Good. I'm glad it does. Yeah, I can't wait until the... Uh... Oh, look at that out the window. What's going on there? Is that the shadow of Saturn on its own rings? Yes. Oh, oh. Cool. Oh. Mm -hmm. Trippy. <clears throat> um, yeah, I can't wait till the rest of the enemies are in this level. It'll be a lot more fun. <laughs> We're finished. Keith and the others went down the access corridor an hour ago to fight the mutants. None of them have come back. Soon the mutants will come for the rest of us. Wow, what a Davy Downer. <laughs> Oh, look at the hidden NOS supply. It's supposed to be Carly's office. Yep. <laughs> Any more questions coming in? <clears throat> yeah, third player's calling you out using an OP weapon. Say again, sorry? Third player's calling you out. Why? Because you're using the strongest weapon in the uh, game. Okay, fine, I'll go to... I'll, start, I'll, I'll whack things <laughs> on the head then, fine. You do what you want to do. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to read this, this uh, question. What if the toilet flushing was just like lights blinking while doing water and weird grinding like some garbage disposal sounds? Gross. <laughs> that would be terrible. <laughs> Imagine hearing that the whole time. Ugh. Our souls. 
Hmm, better heal up. We're gonna see cyborg assassins, but not in this demo. They're almost, aren't they? They're almost done. I they think. are almost done. <clears throat> yeah, they'll be in. They'll be in soon. The animations are done, and the model's done. I think that they're finishing up the. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, no problem. Stay down. I need a soda. Nice. Yeah, don't need that. Did we salt the fries? Oof. No. Yes. Not yet. We're, we have our own. Do we have our own? Uh, we have our own little thing that we're gonna throw in there. I have ideas. <laughs> One of my favorite oh, ones man. is when um, Matt referred to himself as a power gamer. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'll One of my forget. favorite conversations of recent from a meeting is talking about uh, the the beam sword. Uh, Laser rapier? Wants, yeah, the laser uh, rapier. I'm sorry. I keep thinking about the beam katana from No More Heroes. But when uh, people would not stop referring to the modes as, like, erect or... Oh. Oh, the, yeah. <laughs> when it was flaccid? Yeah, they're like, oh, yeah. They're like, when the weapon is flaccid. <laughs> and I was like, are we really using this word? It went on for like five minutes too before anyone said it. <laughs> I think everyone was holding back. I was giggling. <laughs> There's a reason I have pushed to talk. I have to think a little bit first. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that's wrong. Yeah, I always get these wrong. I should be right. These kinds of puzzles always make me think of um, uh, that one game that came like pre-installed on old Windows OS, like that pipe slime game. Oh, yeah. I don't know what it was called. Yeah, Pipe Dream. Yeah. <sighs> to that awesome that the uh, Oh, yes, that too. The pipe one? Yeah. Ooh, flat fingers with the uh, obscure reference there. Dan, you junction gotta point. change the... Uh, <laughs> yeah, you gotta change it to junction point. <laughs> um, Tala mentioned that that they feel as if that puzzle is not colorblind friendly. I don't know if there's color swap options that we had planned to have or not. Um... There, there will be. Um, We're anti-colorblind. So. <laughs> oh my god! I have spoken to Matt about it, and he says it's quite easy to do. So. Cool. Also, that there, I think this is already known because it's been talked about on the Discord server. Is that you could jump over the bridge without doing the puzzle? Yes, you can. Yeah. So we. We knew th we knew this, <laughs> but we didn't have time to fix it. Now, a moment of silence for the best audio log in this level. <laughs> All right. I must be one of the last ones who hasn't changed. Shodan must have altered the healing machine. I installed an alpha quadrant. It does things to people now. I uh, I think I saw Beth yesterday, but she had so many implants, I c couldn't be sure. <laughs> yeah. He's just so like machine, yeah. Uh -huh. I know I can set things right again. Another day. I know. Just like, just random in passing, he passed her in the hallway on the way to the water cooler. Is that <laughs> Beth? That's Man. weird. Hey, There's so many wires and implants, I can't even tell anymore. Oh, well. I just <laughs> imagine, like, somebody with a printer, like a printer for a head just turning. <laughs> <laughs> Typical Beth. She's into really weird fashion. It's almost like that, um, that Futurama meme where 
fry, his eyes get real like he closes his eyes and he's like, hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure if Beth or Michelle. <laughs> Someone's saying asking, uh, could you make it so the cyborg surgeon would attack if you killed their patients? <laughs> we have talked about That's that. Interesting. We have talked. Yeah, that's a good that, idea. Yeah. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> 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 no penguin does fast. The fast one is when beef pants goes. Hi, Beth. <laughs> okay, see ya. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part of that was you said beef pants said. <laughs> That's their name. <laughs> I'm gonna give them credit oh, for their funnies. Uh, beef pants. Oh, um, Sir Kane found a way to cheat through here too. That's Sir Kane. You can jump on the cheats. side of the wall there. Yeah. Instead of going, yeah. yeah. But I mean. You can if, if you're if you're pro gamer like me, you can actually run and jump <laughs> you're across pro there with gamer. it. Yeah, <laughs> if you, uh, if you you can just run and jump that gap. You have to time it very precisely, otherwise you'll bonk your head on that ceiling. Well, <laughs> it's not that you can. You don't even have to do that. You can climb on the side of the wall. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. I was impressed. Thank you, Sir Kane, for. Ooh, go. <laughs> <laughs> I made myself jump with my own trap. <laughs> oh, Draco Star. Uh, right. That was John Paros who did the the groaning and the grunting. But you know, ever since like I'd say probably 1996 when they introduced jumping in Quake. Every time I jump or go up the stairs, I'm. <laughs> 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 I just Sounds imagine like the, uh, <laughs> the hacker just like dabbing while doing these six strats. <laughs> <laughs> you take that back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you just go all the way back for that. Yep. You've got first aid kits. Yeah, but I'm being conservative. Rocket jumping is better than crouch jumping. I said it. Wow. <laughs> oh, Wolfenbach. This is the longest streak I've seen. 20 months. Oh, wait, wait. No, they're a seven, 17 month streak, but they've done 20 months total. I see. Oh, man. Almost the longest. Ow. I wonder. Twenty months of money laundering. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> oh, didn't work. <laughs> I'm wrecking the station. Yeah, we gotta. I gotta um, put that on the task list actually for our animator to do the, the Unity demo. You would put out your hand on the top of the map. This elevator serves me alone. I have complete control of this entire level. With cameras as my eyes and nodes as my hands, I rule here in Sanctuary. Yeah, okay. Not getting that. Are you going to replace that wall there to with a. Cyborg units, just wall. as we have sanitized my do 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 so shall we cleanse the earth. But the Tachyon mining beam is being made ready to destroy human cities. I, I will take command. Did someone just down a water bottle? Yep. Oh. 
I was looking away from the stream. I was like, what was that? Planet23K is asking why there's a subject in Shodan's uh, DM. You're just showing off the respawning in it. Yeah, I, I am. Know what <laughs> Guilty. We need to have uh, that system that's in System Shock 2 where if you run too fast into the wall, you actually have to hurt yourself. We <laughs> use a speed boost. Skates, just bump into everything. Oh, look at that guy! Whoa! Yeah. Fix that! <laughs> oh, <look at> that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he almost got ya! He did. Manager, please. <laughs> Use the first aid kit. I like to follow the complete. Hey, I got three of them. Oh man, this patient. Ooh, shrapnel removal. Oh, it's spelled wrong again. Oh. But that's. Kevin. All Wait. right. <laughs> but. Why is the other one? I'm so confused right now. Because there's more than I... one texture. That could be why. I don't know. That's. I'll have to. Uh, I'll, take, you I'll take a gander. Yeah, cool. You do that. Fix it. <laughs> Cryogenic. <laughs> oh, I've never felt dumber. <laughs> There's 71 people here, witness to that. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Cyborg conversion cancelled. Standard station restoration procedures online. We underestimated Shodan. He's re I mean, it's reprogrammed regeneration rooms all over the station into cyborg conversion chambers. Anyone going in to get healed comes as a cyborg. I've disconnected the medical CPUs from Shodan's main data bank, so we can reset them to their normal healing functions without Shodan noticing. I'm on my way now to reset the one on the hospital level. Any more questions coming in? <clears throat> you kept this in speech. It's a placeholder uh, at the moment, but I'd love to keep that voice kind of everywhere that it appears. <laughs> it was Stephen Hawking's wheelchair, that's right. <laughs> oh. Oh. I don't think it fell far enough. It has to fall far enough for it to do damage. I don't think it fell far enough. Sucks to be me. Looks pretty heavy. I think it would hurt regardless of where it fell. It could weigh like two pounds though. I don't know. It's the future. <laughs> Directive to Cyborg F71. Uh, a question that says, uh, any chance the cameras could be more messed up when destroyed? Experiment V5 to Beta Grove on the on the there will be, or is it not already in? There was something that we were gonna do with that. They need a flinch animation for when you actually hit them. They need to like sway or I forget. But yeah, they need a little bit. Of Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
there's a question asking if there will be more ambient music. Uh, um, oh, yeah. I would as assume so. I, I feel like we already have a lot that's been made that's not in yet. All these items. I wonder if my pants are on the sun. <laughs> oh god, he hurt me. <laughs> no! Stupid. Go away. When they hit the ground, it sounds like you're dropping like a quarter pound of sliced ham on the counter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. Uh, in the original game, there's a uh, different enemy up there, isn't there? There's yeah, there's a, um... a Cyborgoria. That's right. Uh, but he's not in yet. He's on his way. These guys have the misery. Um, someone's asking a question about when they'll be able to play the demo. If you're a backer, uh, whether it be through Kickstarter or backer kit, as long as you marked Steam, you should have a key to keep playing. Um, I know people that already downloaded before are gonna have to uninstall, enter the demo key in, and reinstall, and that's all. get that sound effect I actually choked John. <laughs> that is actually believable. Oh my god. <laughs> Imagine Homer strangling Bart is really the image that comes to Why are you little <laughs> <laughs> If Wise don't start crushing this game one more time I'm gonna <laughs> <laughs> <That's too real. laughs> Keep close to home. Right, a lot of noise. I won't be able to hear. Sorry for the, sorry for the, uh, the amount of noise that's about to happen. But it's got to be done. and probes scan your body, but you do not match any employee file. When my cyborgs bring you to an electrified interrogation bench, I will have your On a little box asking something that we kind of talked about earlier, about pain uh, um, the question is, will the cyborg surgeon become more aggressive at some point? And we did mention that we have thought about uh, some different elements for him. The code will be random, yes. <clears throat> so when this demo comes out uh, on Steam later, um, I will have an actual ambush <laughs> in place here. Um, it's not in place yet, but it will be.
Oh, thank you, Mickey, for the hundred triangles. Mickey, you Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey, Mickey. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. <laughs> That's stuck in my head now. <laughs> it's payback for that spelling error. That's oh fair. God. It's completely fair. I'm gonna go stand in the corner. <laughs> approaching the end yeah that's pretty much it huh mm -hmm. so yeah in the next update there will be proper respawning enemies around as well as several other things yeah there should be new weapons hopefully cyborg assassins um hopefully yeah and I know that the animations are being worked on for the cyborg, uh, the dudes with the, like the praying mantis arms. What are they called again? The assassins? No, those are like the the, the other assassins. Yeah. Oh. Because we got the regular assassins with the machine guns. Remember? Oh yeah, yeah. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Rebecca. They're trying to jam transmissions. We have some new evidence about what happened. Is Tell us if Diego has... I prefer a quiet station. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that button right there, Dan. I was wondering if you were going to put that on a tile that had a... For it. Can do. Maybe. I don't know. Your your choice. <laughs> no pressure. Yeah, I can do. Oh, that's it. We need some screens in there too, huh? Uh, so we uh, have. Yeah, we could put on this screen where the player is, by what floor they're on, because uh, you'd expect that. <laughs> I like the kazoo version. <laughs> the best part is, is I have this muted right now, so it's just like, I watch it and I just us. hear the acapella version. <laughs> it is really beautiful, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It's, uh, yeah. It's its own reward, I think, for finishing the level. It is. Pretty great. I think I got all of the audio logs as well. Well, I should do. Oh, well. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it for the demo. Um, what do we want to do next? <laughs> what do we, we want to do next? <laughs> uh, do we have anything that we could show people as a sneak peek of anything? I'm not sure if we do. I don't have anything set up. Um, Dan, is your editor open? I couldn't run the game and the editor without it possibly being a bit choppy. Ah. Um, I was going to say you could probably show off a little bit of maintenance or research if you want, or um, I'm not sure, but you could talk about some of the updates that are coming to System Shock Enhanced Edition on Steam. Oh, yeah. We have um, 
complete engine redo over of um, uh, System Shock Enhanced Edition using uh, the latest all singing, all dancing version of the, the Kex engine. So that'll be coming out um, to support the uh, physical release um, from Limited yep. Run Games. Yep. Um, Which I'm, is a DRM free release, by the way. Yeah. Uh, I'm not. 100% sure on the date myself personally but um, yeah that's that's that, that'll be going live soon um, and that's got uh, some really cool new features one of them is there's some new artwork that we mm. put in to support uh, widescreen right yeah yeah we've got um, yeah exactly what Steve said new art to support uh, widescreen stuff will it be on GOG I believe so. And then um, we are putting the Mac and Linux versions on hold for a little bit um, because we want to get right into um, System Shock 2 EE. Yeah. So we'll probably do both of those at the same time. Um, what else? I know that the... Uh, I just talked to Limited Run today, actually, and they're... They sent over some samples of um, some of the bonus goodies that are included in the box, including the um, uh, the human mutant oh, uh, little um, pewter figurine, uh, which is really cool. It's actually based off of a model that we made for this game. So that's really cool. Um, the vinyl record looks amazing. It's translucent green. Um, the cover is uh, like a hollow foil print, which is really beautiful. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, if you want to turn off bits of the hood, you can do. <laughs> I forgot to mention that in software. That's a thing you can do. People can go around and play with it right now if they want. Mm -hmm. um, we're not decided yet on System Shock 2 EE. I I want to say again. Don't quote me on this, but if you have, <laughs> if you have System Shock Two already, um, yeah, I'm not sure actually. I can't say. <laughs> um, um, we'll have a the, Kickstarter uh, update at the end of the week. Maybe we can write something there. I don't know. Perhaps uh, we could do. Uh, what was I just about to say? I might change that from uh, saying undiscovered to space. We could do, um, oh my god, I'm totally drawing a blank here. <laughs> um, I was saying that because System Shock EE is running on our Kex engine, we could conceivably do a port to uh, <laughs> to Nintendo Switch. I don't know how, <laughs> how wow. crazy that wow. would be, but very. Uh, we could potentially do it. Quick question for Dan. Noticing he's hovering over areas of the map with more areas specifically labeled, or is the labeling done? Um, so they are labeled by quadrant, um, except some areas which um, are kind of they don't really have a kind of quadranty area like these. Um, we we have this area called the maintenance tunnels internally. It's called Pipe World. So if you hear us talk about Pipe World, we're talking about these tunnels. Um, but they they are their own um, kind of entity in the um, it's it's all kind of how the BSP is laid out whatever the BSP is kind of referenced in the game and it's how I split the if you're watching the BSP split up uh, when I was doing that I split the um, parts up we're using those parts as the names for uh, these bits of the station but we can split them up further if, if we want to I mean uh, the um, the recovery suite is called neuroscience um, in this uh, demo version it might change and when you go out you're in Delta and you yeah you go along you've got the central hub so because Rebecca says you need to get to the central hub and the player will be thinking oh where's the central hub so it's level central hub on your map uh, someone's asking, will the enemies react to noises from switches getting flipped? Uh, I think they do. 
I think. Maybe they don't. I don't know. I'll have to ask them out about that. But uh, they might do. But that could potentially break a lot of things um, that we already have in place. So, don't know. We'll see. Uh, so, can't, give, can't really give an answer on that one. Yeah, people are talking about being able to write your own notes on the map, which I know was a feature in System Shock 1. Um, um, yeah, I did that was something that we were going to do, wasn't it? I did chat to Matt about that, um, though I can't remember where that conversation actually led to. I'll bring it back up with him and see what he has to say. Man, I've got 4%. I'm going to go find this last camera while you guys chat. Last camera, huh? Mm -hmm. Do you know where it is? Probably somewhere really stupidly obvious. Like always. You guys keep chatting. Now I'm there's watching. the pressure to chat. <laughs> Man, the purple head looks so good. It does look nice. Purple mm -hmm. calms me. Where are you, camera? <laughs> Sir Kane said, did you check the restrooms for cameras? <laughs> wow. Would try up to him do such a thing. That would be a workplace violation. I'm sure OSHA would be. <laughs> oh, you will be happy to know, Steve, that when you check these railings, uh, yeah. they, they, it's OSHA compliant. Oh, are they? Yeah. Oh, good. It's a railing. It's OSHA compliant. Ship the game. Excellent. Still more railings than Star Wars. Oh, news who backed the collector's edition of the SS remake in the little figures as yet. Oh, well, um, I think depending on how well received the Cooter figurine is for the um, System Shock 1 big box that we did with Limited Run, that we probably do something similar with that, but choose a different monster. Maybe the Cyborg um, uh, Warrior, because he's kind of iconic. A beefy miniature. <laughs> um, Jack Bauer, eighty-five is. Sorry if you already addressed this, but can you come on comment on the darkness level in the demo? Yeah, we um, changed some of the post-processing effects to bring the like the ambient lightness up all around, so that there's no areas that are completely dark like there were originally because it was just too too dark. We'll find you, camera. How do you reload the Magnum? It's, oh. uh, it's still isn't it? Oh, is, no, I mean, uh, switch ammo types? Oh, uh, right now it's comma. Um, even though I need to talk to Matt about having that set to T as default, because that's what it's set to be in the uh, tutorial message. So, oh, maybe my config isn't updated. I tend to have this game on all the time, so maybe my config just isn't correct. Sir Kane has my number. He just says, you just want people to buy all the games to complete their figurine collection. Well, oh, my way. you know what? <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> um, Space Minotaur blind boxes. Perfect. Oh, I know. Oh, that's great. Right. How come we can't play that yet? Oh, we should talk no. to Matt. Spoilers. Okay. <laughs> no, shush. Oh, do people know about it already? I don't know. I don't think they do. Well, there's... We've yeah, talked they do, because they showed some stuff. Oh, okay. Camera is here. Oh, you got it. Another Magnus Mark Rise. I am fatigued. I can't run anymore. Take a patch. Oh yeah. Uh, Take a stam, stamina up. That's true. 
Showdown pop vinyl. <laughs> Boy. Off I go. Uh, I've got a, I've got a couple. I've got uh, protein robot Tom Servo from Mystery Science Theater 3000. Yay! Um, the hands are gonna gl uh, grab onto the ladder. Kevin just finished the new model for that, so. Hopefully that'll be in relatively soon. I can't do wheel magnums. Magnum Akimbo. It's a John Woo movie now. <laughs> All right, well. I guess, Dan, as soon as you make your way back to the elevator, we can, uh... We'll call it that. Kind of wrap it up. Any last questions? Anything that we didn't Final answer? Final words. I'm looking at this chat. I don't see. Oh, when's pack back your kit, and when will we close it? Um, probably as we near the, like, when the game goes gold, probably, and we'll make a big announcement so that you can change any info you might need to, like shipping addresses or payment options, that type of thing. So it'll be up for a while. And I promise I'm getting, I'm going to say this like I said earlier at the top. I'm getting to all of the questions about Backer Kit and the demo because I know a lot of people haven't really used Backer Kit before and I will continue to help everyone and I'll post the Backer Kit link one more time. Just let me grab that again. So many questions. I know, now they're coming in. I know, one, uh, let's see, I was wondering if System Shock 2 Enhanced Edition will have partly remastered graphics, will it? Um, I haven't quite decided on that yet. There's some really fantastic user-made mods that improve the graphical fidelity of the game. Um, so you're just going to have to kind of wait and see. I mean, it would be ideal if it was enhanced to that degree, at the very least. Um... But let's see. We're obviously we won't use any fan-made stuff without permission. Are the corpse necks being closed in the doors a design decision or a physics side effect? <laughs> <laughs> there's a little bit of a. I'm not sure if this addresses that question, but there's a little bit of a um an animation issue with the necks getting hit where they like wiggle and jiggle out of control and that's like a, that's a thing that we're addressing mm -hmm. I don't think that's the same question though <laughs> uh, nice console version still on the table probably not simultaneous release right yes we're still doing uh, console versions of this and they probably won't be simultaneous but um, I don't know um, our other team has become extremely proficient in releasing games on uh, Xbox and Switch, and there'll be some PS4 titles coming out relatively soon from us. So, um, yeah, maybe that'll help us um, release all of them simultaneously. I'm not sure. Uh, how many difficulty levels do you think you'll have? Um, can we talk about that yet? Well, it'll be similar to the original, right? Yeah. Um, you will get to um, select some uh, of the kind of like original uh, difficulty uh, settings, so like combat, uh, puzzles, uh, that kind of thing. Um, with some extra, maybe a little bonuses. Who likes Iron Man mode? <laughs> Wiggly jiggly thing. <laughs> Sorry. 
No uh, word on a physical what? Doom 64 release. No word on that yet. I don't know. Doom 64 was talking about that. But the Doom 64 is going to be out uh, on the same day that Doom Eternal launches. Ah, uh, yes. And Animal you, Crossing Day. Yeah, and if you pre-order <laughs> Doom Eternal, you get Doom 64 for free. True that. Uh, there's a question that I don't fully understand in chat. It says, "Is it's true that the final version of the game will have a style that's similar to the Unity version, right? Uh, what you see right now is the final version, or the final, <laughs> the final the style, style of the game, which is very similar to that of Unity. <clears throat> At least I think so. I love the way our, our game's looking. It's beautiful. Sir Kane wants to remind that I need a an Easter egg in the game of me dead in a locker. <laughs> just just okay. with cans of nods everywhere at the bottom saying yeah. just written in graffiti, I drank too much. <laughs> like this nothing on the station killed me, it's just me trapped in the locker for too long with Nas. <laughs> Are we ready to wrap up? I don't see any other questions coming in. Uh, yes, Fragmental Stew, we did, our team uh, developed and, and is re-releasing Doom 64. Um, but that's through Bethesda, so they're actually the publisher on that. That means we're officially allowed to talk about it now. Yay! <laughs> oh, really? Oh, when I <laughs> I, uh... Uh, uh, oops. I mean, Men in Black, quick. <laughs> it's not okay. You know what? You just, you, I'm still gonna blame Dan, but <laughs> Dan. <laughs> I nearly choked on my drink then, damn it. <coughs> mm. I can't get in trouble. No, you're the CEO, it's no, you possible. can't get in trouble, can you? <laughs> Everyone's um, threatening to clip it. <laughs> it vaults <laughs> doom. <laughs> Kevin, you're a wild card. Yeah. I never know what you're going to say. <laughs> never know what's going to happen next with that boy. All right. Are we good? Are we uh, yeah. going to call it here? I think so. Thank you, everybody, Yay. for coming by and watching. This was really fun. Yeah. Um, dev streams will resume at some point. Uh, game streams will resume at some point. Depends on how busy everybody is and... Um, we can't really promise anything because uh, yeah. you never know when people are going to be busy and when they're going to be free and whatnot. Um, and deadlines are a thing, so we'll do Thank what we can. Guys. But uh, yeah. So. All right then. Bye. Bye everybody. Thank you so much. Bye 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 bye. Bye. <laughs> See you guys. Get out of here. <laughs> Be gone. Ugh. Bye.